Hello friends, welcome to the Alpha Point. I'm Vishal and today I'm going to show Samsung Galaxy Note 2 running the Pro Bam ROM based on Android 4.4.2 KitKat version. It is the latest ROM release 1.1. from the Pro Bam team here. So let's see what are the features inside this ROM here. So first take a look at the version number. If you can see here, Android version, baseband version, kernel version. So this is the latest ROM from program team here, Android 4.4.2. So this is it inside this ROM here. Now start with the features of KitKat here. So the first feature is the Google Now, right from, we can use right from our home screen here. Okay Google, what's the weather now? As you can see, it has started searching in the web and it did its work perfectly here. So now just let's see the home screen here. At present it has three home screen here, three bars here. So if you want to add more, just drag an application here sorry any application and it will add more home screen there right now we have four home screen here so or if you want to delete a home screen just delete all the application from that home screen and it will be gone just delete this and we have presently two home screen present in our phone right now now take a look at the lock screen in lock screen we have different widgets available to open the call option music player messaging or unlock the device or browser here we have if we swipe from left we can see the camera application coming out the camera is pretty fast in android kitkat here and in lock screen we also have if we swipe from left we can see to add widgets option here we can add more widgets if you swipe from swipe more then we can add and it will keep going on to add more and more now see the app drawer what application that we have here apollo music player app settings in app settings what we can do is to change the dpi of any application and uh, revoke any permission make the screen extra large uh, remove the notification panel inconsistent notification we can remove the title here. now we have browser we have calculator swipe to get more settings calendar a google calendar and the cam calendar on this rom here camera application google chrome i have changed its dpi to 200 as you can see it is completely changed here if you can see here it has a little bit of change here here three options here we don't need to swipe to get to the another tab we can just see a tab like the P windows version here pc version so you can change the dpa of any application using the app manager here google drive downloads email file manager in file manager it was supposed to just use your internal memory card so if you want if you want to use your external you need to make it root access so just go to general settings access mode and make it root access mode in general it was made to safe mode make it root access mode and you will be, you will be able to use your external sd card it is right here so make that root access there we have gallery gmail application gallery from previous version same it's google google settings hangouts you keep uh, application maps messaging you can change the messaging app in hangouts here if you open the hangouts you can integrate into uh, sms here the movie studio news and weather people phone playbooks play games play music play music these are application has been indicated here we have program updated so that we can update 
this ROM quickly and efficiently. Quick Office has been integrated in the Kit Android KitKat here. Sound recorder terminal, terminal emu emulator has been provided here. So if you want to tweak anything that you can use the terminal terminal emulator, exposed installer exposed installer is also present in the display settings inside settings here. We have voice installer, YouTube. So these are the settings has been here. Now take a look at the notification bar. Just swipe it down and we can see settings here. It is just a hello screen, hello notification in this ROM here. We can disable this. We have these options and we can add more options in the settings here. It is gone since there is no notification right now. I have set to that. Now see settings what we have. Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, data usage, mode. Airplane mode, default messaging app, you can change the default messaging app here. Home personalize, you can change the home screen default. Two home screen has been provided here. Launcher 3 and the launcher. You can edit the lock screen everywhere here. Uh, clock widgets, you can use themes here since only one theme has been provided in this ROM. You need to get from the market. You can change the interface here. You can tweak the status bar, quicks panel settings you can change the battery with percentage only circle or the default you can hide this battery option here or make it icon the default here expanded disk notification draw you can add in everything here so these are the settings here interface hello just what was hello notification bar set settings here Sound setting, display and light setting. We have all the default settings of KitKat here. We have exposed framework here. You can tweak it from here too. Uh, buttons, you can change the settings of your button. Like what long press do, what short press action do. You can change it here. Storage option, battery option. Vibrated intensity here. You can use profiles to save your battery and depending on what you want here, GPS setting location, security settings, language and input, see the languages available in this ROM here. Pretty good number of language here. So these are the language available here. Backup and reset at all your, all your accounts. Organized in accounts here, date and time, accessibility. You can print your documents right from here and the super user here. So these are the settings has been provided here. I am using this you know, from one day and I found it very much stable and I found it very much lag free. I would say the best custom ROM of Android KitKat 4.4.2 available here. The Pro BAM here. You know, must have if you want to the KitKat and don't go for any other rom if you want to have the kitkat version this is the latest release from program and you can tweak it most out of it in settings and in framework exposed framework so thumbs up for this rom here and you can get it from the link provided in the description so and thank you for watching and don't forget to like and subscribe thank you